Well, a hearing just ended in Monroe County Supreme Court. That's where the Rochester City School District is suing the city of Rochester. News 8's Kayla Green just got out of court and joins us live with details on this. Good afternoon. Yeah, Leah, so the judge took the chance today to hear both sides, both from the city and RCSD. They both had the chance to present their sides of what they think about this referendum. So RCSD wants the referendum either removed from the ballot or kept from being put on the ballot, depending on what the Board of Elections has already done. So RCSD's attorney says the ref referendum itself does nothing and is simply an opinion poll. Now the city's attorney came back saying the city charter establishes elected offices like the school board, which allows for board member salaries. He says the city wants to get rid of those seats and remove salaries for five years. Now RCSD says the city can't ask voters to remove the school board or make them pay back their salaries. So they also talked about the letters that were sent out to voters from Mayor Warren, which was something that was going on last week, a controversy among voters. And it, the city attorney says that the voter just told people that they should go out and vote, simply didn't tell them how they should vote. Uh, the judge was questioning the persuasive language, as he said in the letter, such as failing district and vote with me. The city's attorney said that that was, again, just simply encouraging people to go out and vote, not telling them how to vote. Um, so it kind of ended off here with RCSD saying they wanted to move forward before the beginning of the school year and get this all figured out. And the judge said he would be making that decision by tomorrow at 10. And we're not sure exactly yet. He said likely by tomorrow at 10. But that's a little recap of what went down today in court. All right, Kayla, thank you for that update. Of course, it's a story we will continue to follow for you at home.